You can watch Super Bowl 58 right here on 10 TV next Sunday, February 11th. Do you plan to have a little skin in the game? It's easy to bet now that online sports gambling has been legal in Ohio for just over a year. But experts say be careful so you don't blow more money than you can afford. The Ohio Casino Control Commission released a report Wednesday showing gamblers wagered more than $7.6 billion on sports in Ohio in 2023. Mary Haven Behavioral Health says its call volume of people asking for help with a gambling problem has quadrupled since sports betting became legal here. They say if you're going to bet at any time or just on the upcoming Super Bowl, have a plan and a budget. You know your limits, set your limits, um, and not in just terms of how much you're going to wager, but time spent gambling as well. You know, the National Council on Problem Gambling has partnered up with the NFL to air those commercials as well during the Super Bowl and throughout the season. So you should be able to see, you know, uh, responsible gambling tips on your television. And Mahmoud says the group in which they get the most calls for help is white men between the ages of 18 and 44. If you or someone you know needs help with a gambling issue, you can reach out to Mary Haven directly or the National Problem Gambling Helpline at 1-800-GAMBLER for support, information and resources. This Sunday morning at 1130 on Face the State, we look at how gambling addiction affects the brain, how it can impact your finances and family, and ways to avoid the pitfalls in the era of legalized sports betting. We'll also have this week's political headlines on Face the State.